Green now just coming in a little bit closer to the action. Tony Gato. Oh, chance for her to get on the outside. No, good recovery. Aussie women's rugby sevens playmakers, the brains of the team. In rugby, a playmaker is the player with exceptional skills that makes it easy for them to dominate the game. They initiate the game for fellow players, leading them to the try line, while at the same time putting a stop to any attempts by the opponents to invade their try area. We have looked at playmakers in different teams, and in this video we are going to see who indeed qualifies to be called a playmaker in the Aussie women's rugby sevens team. Be sure to watch this video to the very end, especially if you are a fan of one player who makes or breaks the game and would be happy to know who this is in the Australia's Aussies women's team. Before we jump into it, let's look at some fun facts about the team, so you appreciate the contribution of the playmakers to its overall performance. First up, back in 2009, Australia women's national rugby sevens team were champions of the inaugural women's sevens world cup. The team is instrumental in the World Rugby Women's Seven Series and is in fact one of the core teams on the world tour of which they were crowned champions in 2015-16. Their stakes in terms of performance are pretty high, since they are known to compete in the Pacific Games Sevens since 2015. Also in 2016, they were the winners of the inaugural gold medal at the Rio Olympics. Impressive, don't you agree? Now, with this spectacular performance, there are bound to be players who have been the engine of the team all along. You know, the ones mainly responsible for this performance. So, who are they? Let's find out. Alicia Lucas Closing our list is Alicia Jane Lucas, born on the 28th of March 1992. She is a professional Australian rugby union player and represents Australia in international rugby sevens. Alicia is 5 foot 8 and weighs about 129 pounds. She was born in Wagga Wagga in New South Wales, Australia. Having played for The Tribe at a club level, she debuted for Australia in May of 2013. Alicia also represents Australia in touch football and was a part of the team which won the Touch World Cup 2011. With such an impressive track record, it is not hard to make out that her team has enjoyed much of her playmaking privileges. Playing mainly in the back positions of the pitch, Alicia is one of those female players who is a pace setter. She sees gaps in opponents' formations, spots out unmarked fellow players, and does unexpected kicks when she determines that it is the sure way to score that try. If you watch the various matches she has played, you will notice a player who understands how to play with a team spirit while at the same time not afraid to step up when game situations require her to do so. Madison Ashby Next we have Madison Ashby, the 20-year-old rugby sevens players who got famous for wanting to rewrite the record books and become Australia's youngest rugby player back in 2014. Ashby is so talented that within just three months of playing rugby sevens in 2014, her coach and parents had already decided to lobby the ARU to allow her to compete for a place in their women's team to play in the 2016 Olympics. Ashby, whose fire to play with other girls was kindled before she was even eligible to play professional rugby, is known for shocking many opponents with moves on the pitch. She is mostly unpredictable and keeps any team up against her guessing for the whole time that she is playing. With many of her coaches commending her for being a good student, she is very keen to learn from her mistakes and become a strong player even through criticism from both sides of the game. While there is little said of her playmaking abilities, you will be blown away by her understanding of the game, her speed and her tact when you watch her play. Hey, are you enjoying this video so far and getting entertained? If yes, then please consider visiting our channel Tryline which is home of all amazing facts and developments in the world of rugby. And the top playmaker in the Aussie Women's Rugby Sevens team on our list is... Drumroll please... Charlotte Kaslik. Born on the 9th of March 1995, Kaslik is all you would expect in a playmaker and much more. With a height of 172 centimeters and a weight of 66 kilograms, she played every sport growing up. Hockey, athletics, swimming, touch football, and when she was about 16, she got a letter from the Australian Rugby Union asking her to come down to a Rugby Sevens camp and started her whole journey. 
the Rugby Sevens player whose hero is Australian Rugby League footballer Jonathan Thurston, aims to play in three Olympics before the end of her career. Watching her play, it is not hard to see her achieve this ambition. Kaslik is an exceptional player on her team. From changing direction abruptly at full speed, to assists that no one saw coming, not even her teammates, all the way to the most humorous fakes that make the crowds go wild, in a game that was previously thought to only be played by men. With her coaches very hopeful about the growth she will have seen by the end of her career, Kaslik remains a beacon of hope especially to young women aspiring to play rugby in Australia. That is all we had for today and we hope you enjoyed it. Did you agree with our list? Are there players who you think we left out? Or who deserved a different position than the one we awarded them? Please let us know in the comment section below. Until next time, stay safe.